How does electric current flow in a circuit? Electric circuit comprises of four inseparable components that if successfully connected to form a closed loop, makes electric current flow possible. A closed circuit is a complete circuit since it offers an unbroken path to allow the continuous flow of electrons from the negative to the positive terminal of a battery cell. An open circuit is an incomplete circuit since there is a break that impedes the flow of electrons. In a simple electric circuit, these four vital components can consist of battery, copper, switch, and a light bulb. Each play a significant role in producing electric current. The battery is the energy source, it supplies the required electromotive force to cause the electrons to move in the circuit away from its negative terminal and pulls them towards the positive terminal. It is the provider of voltage, not electrons as many would think. The copper is the conductive path, which provides a pathway for electricity to pass through it with greater ease. Metals are known for its electron mobility, due to its loosely bound electrons in the outer shell surrounding the nucleus. Its loose electrons with the aid of the voltage will move around the circuit to produce current. The switch serves the purpose of regulating the flow of electrical current within a circuit. It works in an on and off mechanism, that by turning the switch off it creates an open circuit, emphasizing a break circuit, and that by turning the switch on it creates a closed circuit, emphasizing a complete circuit. The light bulb is the load which makes the circuit nothing in its absence, since it serves as the main building block, as it is the component that is energized, when the electric current passes through a bulb, it heats up the filament and gives out the light energy. So to summarize, electric current is produced when the free electrons in the atom of a metal wire starts to flow, when applied with voltage through energy source, this conductive medium aside from being the source of electrons also links the rest of the components forming the continuous path, the flow of current is then controlled by a switch by turning it on or off resulting to the closing or opening of the circuit, through a continuous current flow it will then reach the load where the electrical energy will be converted to another form of energy, in this case, to light energy.